Welcome to Octopus Tutorial. Octopus is a web scraping tool specifically designed for mass gathering of various data types. In this video, I'm going to show you how to configure scroll down to refresh pagination for extraction. Scroll down to refresh feature can be found in many websites such as Quora, Facebook, and Twitter. In most of the cases, pagination is needed when configuring extraction, because usually one page of data is not enough, so you need to add a page navigation action. I'm going to take Quora for example. First, you need to navigate to the target URL. Enter the URL right here. I'm searching the topic about web scraping. We are now on the search result page. Wait until the page loaded, select the advanced options. Choose scroll down to page bottom when finished loading. Then enter how many times you want to scroll. Select internal time and scroll way. I choose scroll down for one screen. You can also choose scroll to the end of the page. Now we're done configuring pagination. Next, select the first answer. Create a list of item. Add current item to the list. Continue to edit the list. Then select the second answer. Select add current item to the list again. Then select finish creating list. Click loop to process the list. Now, Octopus will automatically repeat the selection. Then you can scrape whatever you want on this page. Click on the title to scrape the title. Choose Extract Text. Choose Views, Answer and Time. Then change field names in the defined field. Once done configuring extraction rules, click Next. You can choose not to load images to speed up the extraction. But sometimes may cause problems on certain websites. Click Next. Now the task is completed. Choose the local extraction to run the task on your computer. The data extracted will be showed in this pane. And we can also see the configured rule of the task. You can also check out the build and browser to see if the task runs as expected. Export the results to Excel files or other database files and save the file to the computer. The result looks pretty good. You've seen how Octopus extract data from the website quickly and effectively. For more tutorials, please check out octopus.com. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you next time.